Hey everyone, welcome to reacting to SMG4, the Mario documentary by SMG4. Now, I have not seen this, but uh, this looks like it's going to be a nature documentary with Mario, and yeah, <laughs> that's that's really it. That's that's all I say. It's just going to be a nature documentary with Mario. And it's going to be making fun of, like, the nature documentaries in general, which is, could be funny. But, uh, yeah, anyways, guys, we're changing the description, make sure I've SMG4, and I'm the description, let's just get right into it. This is so nice. Mario's house. In the wild, we see the wild Mario in his natural habitat, searching for food. Yeah, okay. No spaghetti. But something is amiss. Luigi! <laughs> With a lack of food source, he turns to a family member for help. What? <laughs> He's like, what's the narrator? Mario finally commits an act of extreme violence for his spaghetti. Okay. So it's just a normal SMG4 episode with a narrator. Oh. I love you! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Mario documentary. Yeah, it's just an SMG4 episode with a narrator. Mario sneaks onto the hunting ground to hunt for more food. Come here, fishy, fishy. Okay. <laughs> Wait till these guys get a load of my head. Oh, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> What is that model? <laughs> Spaghetti. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Who? What's this? A competitor. Egg. The egg. The egg guy. Yeah. We see the Mario preparing to lunch for his bread. A cat. What an absolutely intense fight. Oh my god. And he won. And thus, his opponent has been defeated epically. What a bitch. <laughs> Mario now begins his mating call. Hey, Stinky. You like it? Are you sweating? The Mario is successful. With the mate successfully seduced, Mario begins his mating ritual. Consuming. Suddenly, the ride returns. <laughs> what you gonna do, huh? Oh! Oh, yeah! Ah! Will you be the father of my babies? It seems the rival's mating call was more seductive. Okay. Away defeat, knowing he has been best Will Smith. At alpha male. No home, Mario is prone to the dangers of the outside world. Like personal gym trainers. Let's stretch our legs. <laughs> looks like Mario has started his new life. At a local Starbucks. La 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 Hey overalls, you suck. Hey lots. <laughs> Too bad that didn't kill me. Whoa! Thank you so much. Bob? Yo, what's up, neighbor? Oh, it's Bob. Nowhere else to go. Mario seeks an oasis at the local homeless shelter. Next! Ooh. Hey, Stinky! Take my pill so that I don't murder you. Take my pill so that I don't murder you. Hey, Jack Black. Nice. The f is that? Next! Security! 
Hmm? Oh my god, yeah. Another Will Smith reference. Oh! Good. Giving up any form of independence, Mario freeloads off other humans to survive. Now, what does the Mario do in his relaxation time? Ah, we see him absorb knowledge and become an even smarter being. It's just the evolution of Mario. Oh dear. It seems as though the Mario has been separated with his child. Oh, what's this? It appears the Mario is attempting to communicate with another species. Anime girls. Oh my god. Like that, the Mario has been reunited with his long lost remote. La la la! Yes, that worked. Uh oh, it seems as though Mario has an unwelcome mm -hmm. visitor. This creepy predator, also known as Peach, closes in on her prey. Mm -hmm. and then. Oh! <laughs> Mario's fight or fight response kicks in, and he runs for his life. Okay. Peach does her primal scream, summoning her children. How is that? The toad. Cody Blanchard. Oh, and what a dog! To <laughs> the crowd. The Mario is using his camouflage technique to escape the princess. Doesn't work. And just like that. The Mario's fate is sealed. Here, we see the Mario doing chores, like Peach's taxes. What? <laughs> okay. Oh my god, Yoshi. Consulting a professional accountant Insert tax fraud joke here. Yeah, literally what they're doing. We are experiencing a rare event, ladies and gentlemen. Mario is experiencing... Oh my god. <laughs> the Mario decides he's sick of this shit and fixes things in his own way. Oh. Oh yeah, wait. Basking in his glory, Mario walks off victorious. Hmm? We see the alpha male from before assert his dominance, telling him he has no bitches. Oh my god. But not again, Mario thinks. He plans to confront the alpha male. And to do that, he must become the alpha male. Mario screams, attempting to intimidate his foes and earn the title of Alpha Male. Hello and thank you for calling the Mental Health Hospital. Oh. Ah, damn it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the Mario does a ritual, asking for supreme power from his local god. His local god. Fascinating. What the hell is going on? With self improvement <laughs> and okay. Mario turns to one final solution. Oh, yeah, the hotel. Hey, <laughs> is that the door? Door stuck? Don't make me kick your ass. Oh, Mamma Mia. Mario musters up his ultimate skills to solve this predicament. Be as annoying as possible. Ah! After a long journey of self-development, Mario returns to his territory to confront his rival. One. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Jojo. Uh, Jojo. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Hello. Uh, can I have some memes? Thank you. <laughs> no. The alpha male Ow. has made one oh, serious no. mistake. What sick man sends babies to fight me? He has awoken the true alpha. The oh. true alpha? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is this video, honestly? Well, there he goes. That's very illegal. How about no? Bye bye. And Mario is victorious. He has claimed dominance and his home once again. <laughs> Mario is happy. Hmm? It looks like Mario has spotted something. What are you doing? What's hey. going on here? Oh no, he spotted us. Oh crap, the jig is up. Run, David! Yes, that does seem like a good idea. Oh my Jesus! <laughs> I don't know who David is. I guess it's like making fun of like the vo the narrator. Honestly, this video was so-so. Uh, not not bad. Like, not bad. There were some funny it's it's kind of laughable. It's like so cringy it's laughable. Like that's the thing, because this was really cringeworthy, honestly. Like, it was very cringeworthy, <laughs> but like in a funny way. It was like, it's so cringeworthy that it's not really painful. Well, some bits I, I felt were cringeworthy and painful, but this one was like cringe. Some, most bits were cringeworthy in a way that was funny, but like either way, you know, it's understandable if people like this one because they could find it funny or despise this one because they could find it cringeworthy. Personally, I'm in between. There are some things that I find funny about it, and some things I find cringeworthy. But, like, I could see why people would find this cringeworthy or find this funny. So, yeah, this was okay. Not really good. Not really bad. Just, you know, I'm indifferent about it. But, yeah, anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed the like, through the show, and I'll see you next one. Bye!